Lainey from Lux and Lux of Hairstyles and today I'm going to show you a Halloween do and I'm just going to put these little scorpions I got them from the dollar store in my hair and I'm going to make a whole spider web and put them all in. So keep watching. Her hair is slightly damp. I um, started with the top of it done so you can see what we're trying to make here. I have one, two, three, four, five elastics already put in. The middle one is centered, you know, and then they go off from there. They're down about an inch and a half in part lines so that the part lines line up. And I haven't done this side so that you can watch and get the idea of how I did it. But notice how they're staggered so that the front line is in the center of the, of the square behind it. That may not make a lot of sense. So let me part one here and I'll show you what I mean. So take your part and go directly behind the elastic, pulling back toward the back of the head, and then do your side part so that I'm centered on that one and following the part line of the other. Then I take my fine tooth comb and hold the hair out of the way so I can put my elastic in. And notice how the pieces from the front row, I'm taking half of each elastic and adding it to this one in the back. And then I am fastening in my new elastic at the very back of the rectangles that I'm parting into the hair. So take your comb Make a part line directly behind the elastic of the row in front. And then make your other part line matching the one at the crown of the head that is coming across so that you have a nicely shaped rectangle the size of the other ones. And then to this piece I add two hairs. I add half of the, the hair in the elastic next to it, so I have that half. And then I divide this section of hair in half and grab half of it and add it into the strand I'm making and put it in an elastic and make sure that the elastic is at the back end of where your part line is. And then do the same thing with that leftover piece and the hair above the ear. And you should be getting this effect now. So they're coming out in these little V shapes. Notice that whatever was in the previous elastic is then split in half and made into the next row of elastics. Now do the same technique going down your head Sectioning off, I'm going to do three more rows before I get to the base of the neck. So part right behind the elastics that you just did in the row above. The one on the left and the one on the right. Lift up the hair. And I use the back end of my comb or you can use the teeth. And section off the bottom so that it's the same length. I'm going about an inch and a half or two inches. Slide that comb in to hold the hair out of the way for you to fasten your elastic. Divide the strands that are in front in half, each one. Smooth out that hair and put it in an elastic at the back of the rectangle. And then just do this same technique all the way down your head until you've got, until you're at the base of your neck. So this is the last one I'll show you here. And then notice, so we have five rows. You may have a, um, a different amount than I do, and that's fine. So over here on the side, it's not hooked to your head on this one that we're going to put in. But grab those two elastics over there, and they're just free. They're not connected. And then put them in an elastic, and now we will connect them together. So just at the base of your neck, that's a little bit tricky right there. But just remember that those ones on the side before your last link are not hooked to your head. And then I added a little curl in the bottom. That's optional, and then just keep doing these strands down here, even though they're not on your, they're not connected to your head. They're done the very same way, until you end up with an effect like this. And these ones on the side, if you just kind of tug on them, they'll poke out in a diamond shape, just as if they're hooked to the one next to it. Now, once you have it all in, you can get your spiders, and I got these from the dollar store, but they only had scorpions. But you can use whatever you want. So. I'm just going to open up the elastic enough to put in a spider or whatever you're using. You, know, you could use bats or whatever they have. And just slide it into that elastic. Put as many in your hair as you'd like. Some upside down, right side up. It doesn't matter. Just have fun. Happy Halloween.